The brightly colored messages marked a somber occasion. Rest easy now, Jamie, said one mourner. Others used flowers to show their support, filling the hood of this new Carlisle EMS truck. Oh, it's horrible. I people were calling me from the Legion that knew uh, his dad and knew Jamie that used to be on the fire department. They just could not get over it. Now the entire town is left wondering how they will ever get over losing assistant fire chief Jamie Middlebrook. It's so sad, so sad. And there is no answer, only comfort that he died a hero. Fighting the fireballs that exploded from this Laporte business, KFX Incorporated late Tuesday night. When most would run to safety, Middlebrook and others ran into this burning storage barn. That's when the roof collapsed, breaking Middlebrook's neck and claiming his life. What we're going to do is uh, we're going to go down and shake as many hands as we can and tell them that we're sorry. It's not just perfect strangers, but all Michiana firefighters that share this overwhelming grief. A little somber today. There's a few people on South Bend Fire that work really closely with uh, New Carlisle. Uh, there's several in firefighters here that are were close friends uh, with the assistant chief out there, so it kind of kind of hits home. The loss is heavy on their hearts. A brotherhood now standing strong for Middlebrook's widowed wife, who likely never expected that the call for a barn fire on 800 East Tuesday night would be her husband's last.